Hello there and welcome to this first video on adding and this is the column method of addition. I've popped some keywords into this video for us to understand and I've written down a method that we are going to be able to follow to answer any adding question that you might be faced with. So I'm going to do three different examples. The first one asks us to calculate 34 plus 45. So what I'm going to do is follow the steps of the method and make a reference to them throughout. So 34 is the number that I'm going to write down first. And I will do that just there. Then I'm going to add on the 45. That is written underneath and I've lined them up according to their place value, the units and the tens. And then I'm going to draw the lines for the answer space. And then I'm just going to add four and five together. That gives me nine. And then I'm going to add three and four together and that gives me seven. So the final answer to that question of calculating those two numbers is 79. The second question um, asks us to work out the sum of 1,452 and 325. Now, that means uh, we need to add the numbers together, right? And I know that because I know what the word sum means. It means the result of adding some numbers together. So if we do that, we have to line them up in their place value again. So 1, 4, 5, and 2, and then 3, 2, 5. Well, the 3 is worth 300, so that goes in the hundreds column, 2, and five and then all we have to do again is add them so two plus uh, five is seven five plus two is seven four plus three is also seven and one plus there's nothing there so i'm going to put a little zero you can always do that and then that's a one one plus zero one so final answer there the sum of these two numbers is that and then in question three we've got this worded question we've got andy who's got 987 magic beans and benji's got 435 magic beans we have to work out how many magic beans they have all together now that question there requires us to add together the amount of magic beans that each person has so let's write them down and do exactly the same thing that the method suggests four three five and as long as we get the numbers in the right places we will always get the right answer uh, this time we have 7 plus 5, which gives us 12. We can't put 12 here. We put the units here and we carry underneath the 1 of the 12 into the next column. 8 plus 3 is 11 plus 1 is again 12. So we have another 2 there and another 1 to carry underneath. And then 9 plus 4 is 13 plus that extra 1 is 14. There's nothing to carry on. So we put the number 14. And our final answer is 1,422 magic beans because it's in context and it means something. So uh, there we go. In each question, we have done something very slightly different, but it's exactly the same skill. We've understood what the word sum means. Add means collect together. Plus is the same as add. Positive, well, all of these are positive numbers. The answers are positive. The numbers that we've been given are positive. They are worth more than zero. And then I've written the word integer here as a keyword. Now an integer is just a whole number. OK, so there you go. You've learned a few bits and pieces in this first video. Um, please do click the uh, link in the description to find some resources that you can use to practice yourself uh, this skill of adding. And uh, don't forget to check out the rest of my videos um, on Bear Maths. Thank you very much for watching this first one and enjoy the rest.